The way how I am physically in terms of the, you know, the way my, my face is, is, or my body is built, of course, that's a, a basic uh, inherit, an heritage from my parents, obviously. But um, being fit and being in shape, you know, that's something you really have to work on. Claudia Schiffer has kept her supermodel looks at 53 years old thanks to her unique diet, workout regimen, and secret skincare routine. You should find your own, you know, your own well-being, your own the way how you feel the best. And you are always your own person. You just have to accentuate what's good about you. Everyone needs a good exercise routine to stay fit, but Claudia Schiffer uses a fun trick to stay motivated to keep working out. One part of her fitness secret is Pilates. She does her Pilates to tone her legs and abs. Aside from that, she also walks for several minutes in high heels, which tightens her calf muscles and helps her practice her walks for fashion shows. She also relies on yoga to help with her breathing, flexibility, and posture. However, the same routine can get boring really quickly. So Claudia always sprinkles in some variety in her routine to stay motivated. Working out is really not something that you get to and then you can say, oh, I don't have a, ever have to work out again, um, because you have to maintain it and always keep on doing it. Part of that variety also includes a nice trick to ensure she completes all her workouts. I love going for long walks in the countryside with my dogs, but recently I've started working out with my girlfriends, doing everything from cardio to yoga or tennis. Every day we do something new, which makes it fun. I've also started doing online workouts and going on the treadmill while watching Gilmore Girls. Time flies by when you're watching your favorite movie or TV show. An exercise routine needs a diet to go along with it. For Claudia, her diet goes by a specific five plus rule. Nowadays, there are countless diets, but Claudia keeps things simple thanks to her unique diet. Are you a vegetarian? No, I'm not. You eat red meat, do you? I eat very, I, I call it the luxury of, of my diet. Um, once in a while I have red meat if I have a craving for it, um, but I really try to avoid it a lot because I don't think it's healthy. She swears by a five plus diet. This diet allows her to consume a very limited number of calories daily. However, one day a week, she can consume her favorite foods. Since clean and organic foods are sterilized from toxic and harmful chemicals, the gorgeous model prefers eating them over processed foods. The supermodel also loves green and leafy, fiber-dense veggies, so she incorporates them into her diet. Still, she makes time for her favorite foods like chocolates and biscuits. She also makes sure she isn't harming the environment through her choices. We all need to make decisions that affect the next generation, so we eat seasonal, locally grown fruit and vegetables that are pesticide-free and organically produced meat and dairy from local farms. Even though the five-plus rule seems restrictive, the way Claudia does it leaves her with plenty of amazing options for breakfast. Starting your morning off on the right foot is extremely important, and Claudia manages this with a simple morning routine. I have a cup of decaf coffee with homemade almond milk and dates while I read the news on my phone. Then I check my emails before writing a to-do list for the day. When it's time for breakfast, she goes with fruits muesli, sprouted seeds with yogurt. When she feels like having a snack, she will pick sheep's or goat's yogurt and add banana, chia, and flax seeds. But for lunchtime, the supermodel is more strict about what to eat and when to eat. For Claudia, one of the best diet hacks is to have a cutoff time, after which you don't consume too many calories. The way she does it is straightforward to follow. Her lunch includes plenty of fruits, but when she is on location for one of her shoots, she prefers to eat black grapes, tomato juice, and herbal tea. Mixed salad and miso soup are also two of her go-to meals. However, after four in the evening, she banks mostly on water and low-calorie foods. Apart from drinking gallons of water, she drinks approximately one liter of green and herbal tea daily. Both the beverages cleanse her body and give the supermodel a youthful and refreshing glow. But every now and then, she'll indulge in a sandwich with 3.5 ounces of boiled chicken and bread with bran. Because she is so strict in the morning and afternoon, it allows her to have her favorite treat after dinner. Claudia found a fun hack to stay committed to a diet, but before the hack comes into play, her dinner usually consists of salad and steamed vegetables. But her salads are far from bland. 
Two of her favorites are chicken salad and tuna salad. She also enjoys vegetable stew, which is made of cauliflower, pepper, carrot, one tablespoon of peas or French beans, onion, celery, and parsley. The sauce includes one tablespoon of olive oil, 3.5 ounces of sour cream, and a tablespoon of lemon juice. Another of her main dinner dishes is a fruit palau, made of 1.8 ounces of boiled rice, mixed with an apple and 3.5 ounces of other fruit and berries. However, she can stick to this regimented diet program because it allows her to have her favorite treat at night's end. Well, what do you do? do what do you do wrong? Your chocolate? Do you pick chocolate. out? Chocolate. <laughs> Sweet things. Yeah. Do you? Do you, yeah. do you eat a lot? Have you got to watch that? Yeah, I gotta watch that because uh, I'm not a, one of those lucky people that can eat whatever they want and, uh, and they always stay the same weight. No, I have to really watch. I can do, I can go for my cravings one day, but the next day I have to watch that I eat a little bit less. And go and work out. And go and work out. Treats are always chocolate, great red wine, or my favorite, Leo Brose. I also love the traditional old-fashioned German stews that my mother used to cook for me, which I now have when I'm with my siblings in Hamburg. But if she weren't avoiding a really bad habit, she wouldn't be able to have her favorite treats. Claudia avoids one habit that can throw off an entire diet plan. She tends to have three square meals daily rather than five or six small meals. By doing so, she can avoid the habit of snacking. It might not feel like much, but snacking every couple of hours throughout the day can add up to a bunch of unnecessary calories and fat. There are also a couple of other rules that Claudia adheres to. She tries her best not to consume fatty and sugary foods as she feels exhausted from eating foods that are high in sugar and fat. To take things further, she also avoids alcohol and caffeine when she can as it harms her sleeping pattern. However, when it's time to celebrate, she won't hesitate to have a good time. Alcohol, drink, do you drink? No, I don't like alcohol so much. I, I only like the sweet things like a port, port wine. Everything else I don't like because it's so bitter and I like sweet things. One way to avoid bad foods is to have plenty of healthy options. Her favorite happens to be pretty simple to make. There are two recipes that you can follow to look like Claudia. First is the fruit smoothie. To make it, use one cup of fresh fruit juice and one cup of yogurt. That's it, nice and easy. The other is a vegetable ragu. To prepare it, use one cauliflower, one sweet pepper, one carrot, half a cup of peas or beans, one red onion, one head of celery, one medium potato, garlic and parsley to taste. Stir it all together and enjoy. However, poor sleeping habits can offset the best diet and exercise regimen. This is why Claudia has a secret tip to ensure you're constantly sleeping correctly. There are plenty of sleep hacks, but Claudia's way is effortless. Because she travels so much, her sleeping pattern gets thrown off easily. So when she can't sleep, she turns to long baths with Epsom salts and her meditation app. When I can't sleep, I have my Epsom salts bath, meditate with the Calm app, light a candle, and I like to have a cup of chamomile tea at bedtime. Epsom salt baths are also good for the skin, which is another reason she uses them. But no matter how much effort you put into your skincare routine, you might still have bad days. When that happens to Claudia, she immediately cuts out two very specific things. Do you get up in the morning and look in the mirror and say, yuck? Yeah, that happens. Does it? <laughs> when I travel very much, you know, when I'm jet lagged and I don't get very much hours to sleep and I still have to wake up early in the morning and still have to go long hours, that happens when I look into the mirror and I, and I think to myself, oh my God. Claudia has her own secret remedy to take care of bad face days. First, her regular skincare routine is pretty straightforward. I wake up early with the kids and need to get them ready for school, so my skincare tends to be the same, regardless of the time of year. I start with Bamford Cleansing Balm, followed by the Refining Exfoliator. Depending on how dry my skin is, I mix my moisturizing cream with different oils and massage it into my skin. I use a little of the Triple Action Eye Cream and, if I need extra hydration, I use a serum. However, when these things don't work and she needs an extra boost, she cuts out milk from her diet. On a bad face day, I drink more water and stop eating anything with milk or wheat and chocolate, which usually makes me break out. Going for a brisk 30-minute walk outside always helps, plus a good concealer. Try that out next time you have a breakout.